What's up YouTube, Ninjas Worldwide, it's your boy DJ Axis Powers with another Workout Wednesday. This week we are going to discuss fake natties. So natty being natural, um, this is a term used for people in the fitness industry who lie about their use of steroids or performance enhancing drugs to develop their physique. So there's a bunch of guys out there um, who were claiming natty, still claiming natty, Simeon, Ulysses, Mike O'Hearn, you know, these guys are saying that they developed um, their physiques without using steroids or growth hormone, um, just using proper nutrition and training, which, you know, at the end of the day, of course, those are the most important things, um, you know, training, rest, diet, but, you know, if you are using some of these you know, performance enhancing drugs, then your body's just gonna reach a level that's just not attainable by the average person. And I think that's irresponsible. And it's definitely not cool for the people who are, you know, look up to these these guys and really want to, you know, bring out their best potential. And if they're being lied to about how these guys got there, then that's not really cool. And, and that's not really fair at all. Um, as for me, as a natural bodybuilder, I compete in the OCB and the INBF where we're required uh, to take a polygraph test before we step on stage. And then if we win the overall show, which I have not yet, um, still fine for that. But at that point, the competitor would have to provide a urine sample uh, in order to get their pro status. And then uh, competing as a natural pro, um, you have to submit urine samples every time you compete. So that's basically the way uh, in the natural bodybuilding industry um, that they try to keep people away from using uh, steroids and growth hormone, but of course there are going to be people who can uh, try and cheat, who can cheat the system, who can beat a polygraph, and then you know maybe time it so that the, these uh, drugs are not in their system if they you know do win an overall. So of course there's always going to be people who cheat when it comes to competition, and that's just the reality of uh, any time that there's people who really. Um, fighting um, for first place and you know championship um, one of the one more controversial fake nat naturals um, who I've seen in person was uh, Doug Miller who competed at the Gaspari uh, Pro Show 2014 in Cape Cod I competed at the am amateur show where I took second place um, but yeah I mean seeing him his physique was just on a whole nother level um, but he did, you know, he has stated that, you know, he took five years off from competing to really build his gains. And then when he cut back down, you know, that's the reason he had more muscle on his frame, which is definitely uh, believable. But of course, you know, the amount of just peeled muscle he had on stage, he really, um, really just crushed the competition, which it's like, you know, that's the slogan for his company, you know, crush it. So but he's never failed a drug test no one's ever said they saw him doing drugs so if he says it's natural you know no one's caught him then that's good enough for me but you know really he's probably one of the best natural bodybuilders in the world if he is natural so um you know respect to that but for me uh you know i continue i plan to continue to compete in the ocb and imbf and eventually get to the professional levels of those leagues and uh, I'm going to do it just with creatine and some pre-workout and uh, proper diet, training, and rest. But uh, no juice, strictly natural gains over here, baby. So that's what's up. It's your boy DJ Axis Powers and that's my take on fake natties. Till next week, see you later. Peace.